God. I came here to serve my madam. Somebody brought me to Ghana. I had to serve her, to pay her money, and then after paying her, I can be free and do whatever I like. Why? If I want to go back, I can go back. If I don't still want to go back, that's my business. At the moment of going to write my jam, the expenses and everything, my dad died, so the pressure on my mom was like, and at that moment, my brother is not around. Mm -hmm. He wasn't around. Okay. We lost contact of him, so. So you couldn't pay? I just. You just had to step back for the young ones school. to also go to school. Yeah. Was that the reason? Yeah, that was just that. My sister, she has already come to Ghana before, mm -hmm. said, get my madam of her own. So she said to come back. Like, she's my cousin. She said to come back okay. and get married and become a housewife. So she told me and linked me up to the woman. So she linked you like, up. You know, as if I don't know what I was coming to Ghana to do. You knew? I knew what I was coming so to what do. Was to work. So what? To work. To work. So what? Why were you selling water? Ashawo. Ashawo, you tell me. Prostitution. Any girl that said, that uh, they brought me to Ghana did not tell me what I'm coming to do is a lie. Yeah, I told my mom I was coming to Ghana, but I didn't tell her that I was coming to do prostitution. She only gave me her blessings. I just told her that she shouldn't ask me because I, thought I wouldn't want to lie to her. I was actually like you, though. Just like me. My ex was very big. Oh! Just because of the drug. <laughs> if you see me, then you'll be like, hey, sugar, what's up? That was the reason why they were calling me sugar. Because you were nice. That was looking sweet. The difference between Ghana and Nigeria, there is difference there. I have started smoking cocaine from Nigeria. The distance where they do sell it is very far. But now here in Ghana, it's not the far. distance is not far. They will come. Mm -hmm. uh, your mother, she's still working too. She mm -hmm. does too. Yes, she still okay, have she's her big man. Right. She have her big man that mm -hmm. will come. She'll just be inside her room, madam. Yes, madam, please okay. give me now. Mm -hmm. and enjoy with the sofa. As far as when I was learning three, they, they said I should, I should say if I want, because none of, not all of them do understand English. That mm -hmm. I should say, and eh, master pacho, <laughs> hey, Try master say. pacho, mm -hmm. young kolai, the men in Ghana, their life here. Yeah. I've learned them a lot. Like I don't read them away. At that time, the day is still a little bit bright, like seven, eight. Mm -hmm. You call them, and they won't mind you. Mm -hmm. But you will be surprised that that person you call, that do you as if you're a sheep. What is that kind? Eleven, twelve, night, night time. Don't mess with my at all. From here, some more people remember Point Media. So, live talk experience talk show. No, na yade ni asan yadri so ebim. Yebe di abrabo mu em komo. Na yade bin swa yadi si na di yadi amaye hona. And then no, what the better make a cry? It's an se ni pa yene ni beka sam. She no, and she da unko ye eka cry. And she no yade be fra fra. Di a wateni akan. Di a wante so di ane ne school ne certificate ya kwaji yano. Yade hon bro fa yade yade abro. But then you na kai so be subscribe to your channel na maye. Obe like your videos and now comment it and share a day account. Oko Facebook ha binyaye wo all media Ghana TV. Oko TikTok ha binyaye e wo Point Media TV. My dear, how are you? I'm fine. Tell me kasa wong huye ya wote? Wong huye? Wong huye? Wong huye? I don't know that one. Wong huye? So what's in your mind? You just speak English. I should. So how are you? I'm fine. What's your name? My name is Sugar. Shug? Sugar, yeah. is that a name that your parents gave you, or yeah. is it a street name that you picked? It's name I'm answering in Ghana. The name that you have in Ghana, yes. Sugar. Mm -hmm. So why do they call you Sugar? <laughs> do you sell Sugar? No, no. You don't sell Sugar. Don't so then, how sugar. did you get the name Sugar? From my friends. From your friends. Yeah. So why do they call you Sugar? I don't know. You don't know. Yes. Why you are sweet? Maybe. Maybe, mm. but you accepted it. Mm, you don't know why they gave you sugar, but you, you just took it like, oh, they call me sugar, so me too, I'm okay with it. Mm, I'm okay with it. So what name did your parents give you? The one on your date, uh, your, your birth set? My name is Flourish. Flourish? Flourish. Flourish? Yes. Flourish what? Ike Chuku or Chuku. <laughs> 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 it was your father meal where Nigeria means you know, said a medica kind son, yeah, Becon. So is it Ike Chuku or what? No, my name is Flourish Frank. Frank, uh, okay. I know you are a Nigerian, yeah. How did you end up here in Ghana? Uh, okay, actually, mm -hmm. I came here to serve my madam. Somebody brought me to Ghana. Somebody brought you to Ghana? Yeah. To serve her? Yes. Or is it to work for her? Yeah, to serve her. To, to work serve her. For her, her. To pay her money and then after paying her, 
I can be free and do whatever I like. Why? If I want to go back, I can go back. If I don't still want to go back, that's my business. Meaning that you're owing her? Why? Is it that you borrowed money from her in Nigeria and you couldn't pay, so she, she brought you back mm. to Ghana to come and pay for her? Uh -uh. So what are you paying for? How old you wait? How old are you? I'm 25 years old. 25 years old. Mm. Where is your parents? They're in Nigeria. They are in Nigeria. Do you have siblings? I do. How many? We are 18 numbers. 18? Eight. 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 Yeah. Eight. So are you the first born, second or what? I'm the second. Your second born. So you have, uh, you are 25 years. Mm. How old is the first born? My other brother, he's married though. I don't, I can't say. Did you ever go to school? Yeah, I went to school. To what stage? I finished my, um, I wrote my work. You wrote your work. Yeah. Did you pass? Mm -hmm. I got credit, I passed. You passed? Yeah. Did you try going to college or any tertiary institution? Yeah, actually, but something happened, so I decided to stop. What happened? At the moment of going to write my jam, mm -hmm. the expenses and everything, my dad died, so the pressure of my mom was like, and at that moment, my brother is not around. Mm -hmm. He wasn't around. Okay. We lost contact of him, so. So you couldn't pay? I just... You just had to step back for the young ones to also go to school? Yeah. Was that the reason? Yeah, that's just that. Okay. So, you have your mom. Were you eating all right? Was she able to provide food for you and your siblings? I'm talking about your mom. Yeah, she's trying, actually. She was trying? Yes. So then, how did you end up here? And because you're telling me that you owe this person and you're supposed to pay her before you can be free. So what happened? Did you borrow money from her or what? Let me make you understand. Mm -hmm. Like I said, normally my mom is trying, mm -hmm. but the load was like, it's too much. Okay. Understand me. Mm -hmm. And she does have this BP of thing, like, uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Even if the thing her BP gets rise. Okay. So, like, the would my sister, she has already come to Ghana before, mm -hmm. said, became a madam of her own. So she said to come back, like she's my cousin, she said to come back okay. and get married and become a housewife. Mm -hmm. So she told me and linked me up to the woman. So she linked you like, up? You know, as if I don't know what I was coming to Ghana to do. You knew? I knew what I was coming so to do. So what was the purpose? <laughs> like, I don't want to say much, Ja. Normal something like Tutu. Maybe tell concerns. me normal something. Me, I don't know normal something. Tutu, how the things are at home. So I said to come and so I can be able to be sending. I just money. feel like you are trying to cover up something. You are not no. trying to expose it. You are not trying to talk about it. That's what I'm saying. You are now. just hiding it. You are no. not being straightforward. I'm not hiding anything. What did she bring you to Ghana to come and do? Is it what everybody Working, knows? Yes, that's what I'm saying. Should I say it for you? Oh, to work. To so work. Also, what? what? Why? Why are you selling water? Ashawo. Ashawo. You tell me. Prostitution. Prostitution. Yes. You should be listening. You have to say everything as it is, so that people can help you. Oh. Okay. Someone can even call to pay off that money for you, so that you can be free. Do you understand me? Yeah. Because you are still owing her, right? You've not been able to pay all the money. So you have to be straightforward with us so that people will know that, yes, of course, I'm in Ghana here. I'm doing this work for this person because I'm owing her. If you can pay the money for me, I can be free. Is that not it? Yeah, that's just So you just have to be straight. That's why I told you that don't hide anything, okay? Because someone can just watch you here, call us and ask us, how much is she owing the person? We tell her the amount. She sends the money to us. We give it to you to go and pay. Then you are free to do whatever thing that you want to do in Ghana. Is that not what you want right now? That's it. But my, my, my thing over here is, she told you this is the work. You are coming to Ghana to come and work as an Ashawo. Yeah. No and way. you also agreed. Why? <laughs> Me there. <clears throat> see my life here. Mm -hmm. I don't like, because the person is not here, I want to like start spoiling the name or start denying yes. that. I don't know that she mm -hmm. was. Unlike yeah. how some of the girls used to say. Yeah. Nah. Any girl that said 
that uh, they brought me to Ghana did not tell me what I'm coming to do is a lie. Okay. Because this time around, before any lady will come to Nigeria and tell you that I'm taking you to Ghana, they will tell you what just for you not to run away. Okay. That's just it. All right. So I accepted because, one, in Nigeria, they, they, at that time, things was very difficult for us. So I have no options than to just, even due to the situation there, mm -hmm. my mom had to remarry again. So is she married now? Yes. Is the man helping? Yeah, he, he, he is. I, I, I do used to hear good news whenever Did I you call. tell your mommy you were coming to Ghana? Yeah, I told my mom I was coming to Ghana, but I didn't tell her that I was coming to do prostitution. So when you told her you were coming to Ghana, what did she say? She only gave me her blessings. That you can go? Yeah. She didn't ask you what you were going to do? She did. So what I, did you tell her? I just told her that she shouldn't ask me because I, thought I wouldn't want to lie to her. That was just the word I just gave her. And she also accepted and left you? She just gave me her blessing, just trust it. So where did you come? Were you um, brought to Accra or you came straight to Kumasi? I came straight to Kumasi. I was actually staying at Asafo, mm -hmm. home touch hotel. Okay. Uh, from there, they took me to a, a doom. How old were you when you came to Ghana? I, this is my three years in Ghana. You're okay, all right. So yeah. you're 22, uh, you are 25 now? I'm 25 now. Okay, so 22 at that time. Yeah. Okay. I was actually like you, though. Just like me. My axe was very big. Oh! Just because of the drug. <laughs> if you see me, then you'll be like, hey, sugar, what's up? That was the reason why they were calling me sugar. Because you were nice. I was looking sweet. What about I now? I was a lady with a figure eight. So I then how did you lose everything? Did you lose drug. it while whilst doing the shower work no, or the because drug. you went to the ghetto? The drug. The cocaine. You are here to do a shower work. Who introduced you to cocaine and weed? Uh -huh. Actually, uh -huh. the difference between Ghana and Nigeria, there is difference there. I have started smoking cocaine from Nigeria. Uh -huh. But the difference there in Nigeria is that due to one that's my country and that's my state. Mm -hmm. I have to do it the way people won't understand. And I don't know how to put it. Mm -hmm. Like, the distance mm -hmm. where they do sell it is very far. Okay. You understand? Mm -hmm. But now here in Ghana, it's not the far. The distance is not far. All right. So you came straight to Kumasi. Yeah. Then you were staying at Asafu. So men came there. I don't know. Would, do they pay you? Then you take the money to your madam, or they pay her before they come for you. This is how it works. They will come. Your, mm -hmm. uh, your mother. She's still working too. She mm -hmm. does to yes. She still okay, have her she's big, all yeah. right. She still have her big man that mm -hmm. come. She just be inside her own madam. Yes, madam. Okay. Please mm -hmm. Enjoy with the sofa. Mm. So, um. We will be outside. Once our working time is from eight mm -hmm. yeah. p.m. No, 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 no. Six. Sorry. Six p.m. Six p.m. Mm -hmm. Everybody shower, change your bra, your bath, blah blah. blah. Mm -hmm. uh, look sweet. Dress. I look sweet. Look like sugar. <laughs> Actually. Mm -hmm. So that's by the way. Then you dress, wear your whatever, whatever. Mm -hmm. You come outside, start like um at. <laughs> As far as I was learning three, they, they said I should, I should say, if I want, because none of, not all of them do understand English, that mm -hmm. I should say, um, um, master, <laughs> um, master patcho, <laughs> hey, master patcho, mm -hmm. young collai. <laughs> right there. And now, I was going to bro, for maybe I now want to say, my main show, my main show, my main free Nigeria na ba kumase, so I'm going to show so what you say? Or so by no or two, me the equally being who was in a so chairman. Uh huh. Now so chairman to me. And I say, yeah, then I buy some bay and now Nigerian Yakra won't teach him. Now, yeah, then I buy Basha over her. Gana for a Basha for the same, say, you'll be soon take brofono. It's yet, Chiran is all about Uncassa, they must and patch on my uncle lie. Uh huh, to a bar, Tia Chiran. To win your camas and my uncle lie there, that I don't cast a beam. Oh, what you say? Were you talking after that one? Because maybe the person doesn't understand English. If you tell the person, oh, master, I am quite like that, you have to keep mute. 
a person will understand, but if you say it in English, there or if the person is fasting, you just like mm-hmm. master. Mm, come. Then you like. Uh, some will just do. Sexy, sexy. Some will just do. Mm. Hey. Hey. Oh. Ghana men, eh? you men, eh? you are very difficult. But hey. They are very difficult. Because they were not mining you. No, it's not like Ghana you won't start. Well, you won't start. You won't start. You won't start. They make it difficult. With a Nigerian, but not all of them like prostitutes. No, let me make you understand your your brother's <laughs> <laughs> your brother's how like with it the men in Ghana, uh-huh. their life here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, I've, I've learned them a lot, like, I don't read them away. Like, you see, at that time, the day is still a little bit bright, like seven, eight. Mm-hmm. You call them, but they, they won't mind you. Mm-hmm. But you will be surprised that that person you called, mm-hmm. that do you see your shit? Mm-hmm. What is that kind? 11, 12, 9, 9, 10. Don't mm-hmm. matter like that at all. Lines, I just, I don't look, I, I, I just look at them like you just say, you put them speed. Because it's very annoying. <laughs> what are you, what are you doing uh, for when you know that you stick up? Mm-hmm. At least say something like, okay. Later, that, like it annoys me, like the way they, they, they do the thing. I see you're rubbing shit on your body or something. Mm. So that's why. Like, what 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 friend men man now from sex you can now no much chum, but some men man now a ball level new you may use some now no much as some much is idea ba. Say eh be our mum person be who so when you are showing here day age now, but like all this thing that you were doing, were you enjoying it? Actually, at that moment, mm-hmm. it's under two things. Mm-hmm. I was actually, and I was not. So, did, were you the one taking the money? Uh huh. Back to that question. Mm-hmm. Sorry for that. Um. Yes, it works like this. Once they come, mm-hmm. finish fucking. It depends. Short or night. You finish what? Having but sex with them. As long, I've been fucking with them. Mm-hmm. As long as uh-huh, it's no. morning. Sleeping with them. Sleeping with them. Mm-hmm. 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 Once it's morning by six, you shouldn't let your madam come knock on your door. And you're heartless. So. No, wait. Once you're done with them. Like, once you're done with them, no, not like you're done with them, they'll pay your money. Mm-hmm. Like, I'm trying to tell you, six in the morning. Mm-hmm. By six in the morning, you shouldn't let your madam come knock on your door. Mm-hmm. Don't let her knock on your door. Mm-hmm. Because at times they're very wicked and heartless. They do beat also. Mm. If you don't pay, like we do, like every day, every morning, every breaking morning, mm-hmm. every China, we pay two hundred Ghana cities every fucking morning. And if you don't meet up, you will be flocked. They don't want to know. The what about if you you work and you don't get up to two hundred cities that night? They'll keep you outside. So you have to make sure to pay two hundred cities to your madam. And no baby, uh... so, yes, so you can meet up. At times they don't like, they don't, they don't, they don't have that conscious of. What if there's no work today? Like all their own thinking is that you are not serious. You're not serious. But that, the conclusion is, I'm just, I'm tired of it. I'm, I just need to go out. Right? The conclusion is that please, I beg you people watching us, please, people should try and help. So. Yeah. Hmm. Omo no de ma be go Ghana. Say one me ma da omo do mo nje mo, but e wasa wo sorry ano pa. Sexy ba e ma omo ni me bo pun me oso kotu ya two hundred cities e ma omo. Nesa watchre e ma ne do ma ban Ghana be bo acha wo no. Ano pa six ne me me bo pun me wasa wo kotu ya two hundred cities. When ti me nje two hundred na dia ni abo. And it's very sad. Right now, how much are you owing them? Are you still there? Are you sad? God. I'm not there. I left. Why are you crying? Because. Nothing. But you know, like, it's not the end of the road for you. Do you know that? Hmm? Do you know as at now you can correct every mistake? Do you know? 
Do you know that? You can just clear off every mistake, every bad decision that you took, that you think is bringing you in a world that you never wish to be in. Do you know that? And it all depends on your own mindset right now. If you've been able to move from there, I wasn't expecting you to move from that place and end up in a very bad place also. At least if you're moving from here, thinking that it's not helping you, you should just at least be on the streets doing something that can help you rather than involving yourself in another thing. That, that one, I don't even know. This one is, all of them are very bad. But going back to the ghetto also, getting addicted to drugs and everything, you are just worsening everything, or don't you know that? It's better I be there than receiving beating for nothing. What I can just tell you is, to motivate you is, in every testimony, before you end up getting a testimony, you have to go through tests. If you don't go through tests, you can never enjoy your money. You can never enjoy your luxury life. Do you understand me? You have to go through tests. You have to go through emotions. You have to go through a lot of things that makes you feel like, oh, the world has come to an end. After experiencing all those things, then when you start getting money, when you start getting opportunities, when people start helping you, when you start meeting your destiny helpers, that's when you know that, oh no, I've been through this, so if right now I'm enjoying, that's even when you can even testify the name of God. You know that. So when you remember all these things, don't cry about it. You just have to tell Jesus Christ that you are so grateful that he was able to bring you from that thing. Do you understand? So this test, the crying that you're crying right now, a day will come. It will all be part of your testimony. You will just stand in front of a whole crowd, the whole congregation. And you will tell them you will use your test as an advice to all these people. Do you understand? Yeah. Whatever happens in this world has a reason. God has a reason for you. That's why he allowed you to go through all this. So that when you meet people and you're trying to advise them, you can use your story to advise them. Do you understand me? That's true. So don't get sad about anything. Okay? So how are you able to run away from that place? Even as still, she still threatens me. She knows me. Up I, till now. Up till now. She do send messages across. That. Across. There are rotten Ghana that will never find my way back. Because she knows that you can't go back? Not I can't go back or something, mm -hmm. but I just don't go back yet. Why? Mm -mm. Because of the way you're looking? Yeah, I haven't gotten what I want yet. But the situation you are in right now is not even going to make you go back. Because instead of looking, what you, the thing that you are taking right now is just making you look more... Basa basa. She said one person the now. You don't know. How did you run from that place? That's what I want to know. How did you run? It was just a simple something for me. Okay. Like I had a customer in my room. Mm -hmm. That day, like I've had it enough. Like it's like. No, I said no, I cannot. Mm -hmm. Then I had a customer in my room that morning. It was in the morning. Mm -hmm. I had a customer in my room in the morning. That was last year. Mm -hmm. So he said he's hungry. I he need something to eat. He mm -hmm. said, okay, you should give me the money. Because the, like, the only thing that will, when you go some money to your madam, mm -hmm. the only money she's going to give to you is just that your job money. Mm -hmm. She can never give you money up to 20 cities. So the shop money, how much was she? 10 cities. 10 cities a day. Okay. Yeah. After paying the 200 cities. I should tell you that the 200 cities is aside. I should go work your rent money. My rent money is 85 cities. A day? Dodge. Every day. 85 cities. <coughs> so I just. I had to take the money in the hundred cities. Mm -hmm. Like, I still regret doing that to him, Sha, because he's a friend of mine, but I later saw him and apologized and made him understand the reason why I did too. So I tried to lock him inside, mm -hmm. to the things that was inside, my things that was I locked him inside. And I called my friend, she said, I should meet her at Tinker. 
that was how it just everything just happened. <laughs> it's very funny. Yes, it's so, funny. So, when your customer was them, and I was a commodity, and I'm a hundred cities, so I got to food the brain. Then you decided to run away with this can be a lucky customer. Now this can a journey. It's just a madam for the could be a customer corona or demo. Because he was locked inside. And you regret it right now. I I I later saw him and apologize. So and you left you there and you ended up in Tinka. Yeah, like no yes, yes. And Let me just say yes. So that's where you've been from last year till now. No, that's not right. I don't sleep in Tinka. You don't sleep. Where do you sleep? I see all my friend at Your friend, Aswanse. Yes, at Oriel. I do come to think like, for example, as I come this morning, mm -hmm. I will stay with you at night, start at 12, mm -hmm. I will go back, shower, okay. change up and come back. Okay. That's, I don't sleep there. That's just, and you don't, you won't see me there always. All right. So, as at now, you regret coming to Ghana? Mm -hmm. Do you? I don't regret coming to You don't to regret? Ghana. Okay. So, what do you want people to do for you right now? What help do you need? Mm -hmm. yeah. I, I wouldn't say instead of using that, instead of getting the money to go and pay that woman. Mm -hmm. uh, so how I, much are you just, in here? The amount I'm in here, the, I can't remember because it's no longer necessary. Because I told them she. Do you I want to pay her? No, no, no. You don't want to pay her. So Instead, what do you want to do? Do you want to go back to Nigeria or what? I don't want to go back. So what do you want to do? I just need a place to, to stay. Mm -hmm. Then? Get a job. What kind of job? Right. Any job? Any job, as long as I'm getting, I'm earning my salary. Okay. Are you addicted to these drugs? No, I'm not. You are not. But you take them? I do. Are you trying to stop? Yeah. Will you stop when you get job? I swear. Are you sure? Me. Okay. So we should pray for you to stop? Yeah. So anybody who wants to help you should at least try to get you a job and a place to stay. Yes. Okay. But one thing I'm happy about that you've stopped this Asha Wood thing. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I thought you were telling me, oh, you are still there or something like that. Uh, but it's good you're not there anymore. Yeah. And please don't even try to go back there. Um, do you understand me? Let's just pray that someone would do what help us. Do you understand me? Please. Mm -hmm. You should try and help us. Mm -hmm. We beg you. Mm -hmm. Help. Help me, please, and God will bless you. Amen. You. Okay. So, but since I said the work on Osana, you have come two or more beer. Uh huh. So, um, we are giving you this from Mommy, uh, Man Lizzy, Korea. She mm -hmm. said we should give this thing to you. Into no number, it's better screen. So, so I say, oh, boy, na, oh, bet me a day. I boy, no fresh here, so I don't have to No, I. I hope you're not going to run away. No. Because if you want to find you, we will still come there. Oh, sure. Uh -huh. So make sure we'll Just come and meet you there. Just come, say you're looking for sugar. Okay. Somebody must definitely right. come and call mm -hmm. me for you. To Mr. Mo, Mama, 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 what will be story? What is your name? Ne juma ye dene ko ye ne ne juma ni pani ye day ebe kachio. Si no mesho sobe subscribe to your channel. No be like your videos no. Now wa comment ya share. Ejamai ya kram.